Jacaranda trees are a genus of trees in the Bignoniaceae family, native to tropical and subtropical regions of South and Central America. Here are some interesting facts about jacaranda trees. Appearance Jacaranda trees are known for their stunning displays of violet-blue flowers, which bloom in clusters in the spring and summer. The flowers are trumpet-shaped and have a sweet fragrance. The trees have fern-like foliage, with delicate, bright green leaves that turn yellow before falling in the winter. Size Jacaranda trees can grow up to 50 feet tall and 60 feet wide, with the rounded, spreading canopy. They have a fast growth rate and can reach their mature size in as little as 20 years. Habitat Jacaranda trees prefer warm, humid climates with well-draining soil. They are commonly found in tropical and subtropical regions, including Brazil, Argentina, Mexico, and South Africa. Cultural Significance Jacaranda trees have cultural significance in many regions where they are found. In South Africa, for example, the blooming of the jacaranda trees in October and November is a sign that exams are approaching, and the trees have become a symbol of the academic year. In Brazil, the wood of the jacaranda tree is used to make musical instruments such as guitars and violins. Ecological Importance Jacaranda trees provide important habitat for wildlife, including birds, bees, and butterflies. The flowers of the jacaranda tree are a valuable source of nectar for pollinators, and the tree's dense foliage provides shelter for birds and other animals. Medicinal Properties In some cultures, the bark and leaves of the jacaranda tree are used for their potential medicinal properties. The bark is believed to have anti-inflammatory and pain-relieving properties, while the leaves are used to treat digestive and respiratory ailments. Landscape Use Jacaranda trees are popular ornamental trees in many regions of the world. Prized for their beautiful flowers and graceful form, they are often planted as street trees, park trees, or as a focal point in gardens and landscapes. Invasiveness In some regions, such as Australia and Hawaii, jacaranda trees are considered invasive species. The trees can spread rapidly and outcompete native vegetation, causing ecological damage. As a result, some regions have imposed restrictions on the planting and cultivation of jacaranda trees. In conclusion, jacaranda trees are beautiful and culturally significant species with a wide range of uses and ecological importance. From their stunning displays of violet-blue flowers to their potential medicinal properties and use in musical instruments, jacaranda trees have a diverse range of attributes that make them a valuable species. However, it is important to be aware of their potential invasiveness in certain regions and to take steps to manage their spread and protect native vegetation. Unique Leaf Drop Jacaranda trees have an interesting leaf drop behavior. In some regions, they shed their leaves twice a year, once in the dry season and once in the wet season. This unique leaf drop behavior can create a colorful carpet of leaves beneath the tree, adding to its aesthetic appeal. Wood uses the wood of jacaranda trees is highly valued for its beautiful appearance and durability. It is known for its fine texture, straight grain, and rich purple-brown color. The wood is often used in furniture making, cabinetry, and decorative veneers. Historical Significance Jacaranda trees have historical significance in some regions. For example, in the city of Pretoria in South Africa, jacaranda trees were planted in the late 19th century by J.D. Salyers, a government official, to beautify the city. Today, these trees have become a symbol of Pretoria, and the city is often referred to as the Jacaranda City due to the abundance of jacaranda trees lining its streets. Symbolism In some cultures, jacaranda trees are associated with symbolism and meaning. For example, in Argentina, the jacaranda tree is considered a symbol of rebirth and renewal, as it sheds its leaves in the dry season and regrows them in the wet season. In other cultures, the tree is associated with grace, beauty, and elegance. Pollinator Attraction The vibrant flowers of jacaranda trees are highly attractive to pollinators such as bees, butterflies, and hummingbirds. The flowers provide a rich source of nectar, and the tree's open canopy allows for easy access for pollinators making it an important food source for these species. Propagation Jacaranda trees are typically propagated from seeds, which are contained in the tree's fruit capsules. The capsules split open when mature, 
Releasing the seeds, jacaranda seeds are relatively large and are often collected and planted for propagation. However, growing jacaranda trees from seeds can be challenging, as they require specific conditions for germination, pruning and maintenance. Like many trees, jacaranda trees require regular pruning and maintenance to maintain their health and shape. Pruning should be done in the dormant season to minimize stress on the tree, and care should be taken to avoid over pruning which can weaken the tree and make it more susceptible to diseases and pests. In conclusion, jacaranda trees are fascinating trees with unique features, historical significance, and cultural symbolism. From their stunning flowers and valuable wood to their pollinator attraction and maintenance requirements, jacaranda trees have a lot to offer. However, it's important to be aware of local regulations and potential invasiveness in certain regions and to properly care for these trees to ensure their health and longevity.